Are you afraid of viruses while downloading something via torrents? Well, you should be. Torrenting is one of the primary methods of virus distribution. Cybercriminals often merge viruses with torrents to infect your PC. In this video, you will learn methods to check if a torrent has a virus. Use a reputable torrent client. If you are new to torrents, the first thing you should ensure is that you are using a reputable torrent client. You can search the internet for the best torrent clients and use the most recommended one. This is necessary because there are many torrent clients available online that themselves contain viruses. Check the downloading source. The next thing you should check is the downloading source. From where are you downloading the torrent? Is it reliable? Is it trustworthy? Ask these questions before proceeding. Torrent sites that redirect you to malicious pages when you land on them or click anywhere cannot be trusted. If these sites redirect you to malicious pages, it wouldn't be surprising if they bundle viruses with torrents. Make sure your torrent source actively monitors uploaded content for viruses. Usually, private torrent networks that work on an invitation or subscription basis have strict policies against malware-infused torrents, so you should consider such services. Check the comments in Cedars. Before downloading the torrent, make sure to check the number of Cedars. If the torrent has many seeders, it can be considered safe since lots of people are seeding it. If it contains a virus, people wouldn't want to host it on their PCs. You should also check the comments. If the torrent is misleading or contains malicious items, people will likely mention it in the comments. So make sure to read them. Verify the content of the torrent. Once you've decided to download the torrent, the next step is to verify its content. When you open the torrent file, it displays a list of files to be downloaded. You need to verify these files. For example, if you're downloading music, videos, or documents, the file extensions should not be exe. Viruses are often distributed as exe or bat files, so watch for them. Cybercriminals sometimes change file icons to make them look like music or video files, but when you check the file extension, you'll find it's actually an exe or bat file. Enable file extension visibility on your PC if you haven't already. To do this, open File Explorer, click the View button, go to Show, and select File Name Extensions and Hidden Files. If you're downloading XE files themselves, you can't know if they're malicious at this stage. Let the file download, then scan it with your antivirus. Scan the content with your antivirus. Once the file is downloaded, your first action should be to scan it with your installed antivirus. I remember a recent incident. I was downloading a video using a torrent. When I played the video, it said the codecs were missing and I needed to install them to play it. There was an .exe file labeled as the video codec. Most people would run the .exe file to install the codec, but I didn't. Instead, I scanned the file and guess what? It wasn't a video codec, it was malware. The video file was intentionally missing the codec to trick you into opening the exe file, allowing the virus to enter your PC. So always scan your torrent files after downloading. Check on virus total. If you are downloading an exe file via a torrent, you should check it on virus total. It scans your files using several antivirus engines and presents a report. Your PC's antivirus might think the file is safe, while another antivirus might detect something suspicious. So it's a good idea to scan it on VirusTotal. If you follow these steps, you can make sure that the torrent is virus-free.